Bitcoiners like to say, be your own bank. And this year proved why having a self-sovereign option is so important. Having a bank custody all your money can feel safer. They take care of all the security and responsibility of storing your money until they don't. A rough week for the banking industry. The collapse of Silicon Valley Bank. The second biggest bank collapse in US history. Even though ETF and other proxies for Bitcoin exposure are becoming more mainstream, there's nothing like holding the real thing, removing all counterparty risk. People feel safe, you know, putting hundreds of thousands of dollars in banks. They do more research on what iPhone product they're gonna get as opposed to where they put their money. So how do you see this all playing out in the future? Do you think that most people will take self-custody and should? I personally am of the belief that the path to hyper-Bitcoinization is billions of people getting rugged over and over again by trusted third parties, by these different institutions that they trust with their information, with their money, until they realize the need to take personal responsibility over their digital lives, and then they act on it and start using the tools.